Hi everybody and welcome back to Bimini Bliss. It is day two of the 2019 DCC calendar shoot and we are on location in Bimini in the Bahamas and I'm so excited because today we have Molly and Yuko joining us on these Boots Are Made For Talking live from Resorts World Bimini, hashtag Bimini Bliss. I'm so excited to have these two here. First and foremost, you go, because this is her first appearance on these Boots Are Made For Talking. So we'll have to get into a lot of stuff with her, because there's a ton to catch up on, apparently. And then Molly, she's been on once, right? Just one time. Just one time. So we're also pumped to have her back. It's her first calendar shoot. So can't wait to hear her feelings towards everything that's going to be coming up for you in the next, what is it, nine days now? Uh, yeah, eight or nine. Eight or nine, something like that. But let's start with you, Yuko. We're so excited to have you. Took you so long to get to us. <laughs> Come on. I'm so excited. Um, last night, I was like, oh, my God, it's going to be my last, no, my first podcast. And I was like, kind of excited, but I'm kind of nervous. But I'm okay. Like, Molly and Courtney's there for me. I'm Yes, Just I got do you. Don't be nervous. <laughs> be excited. We're excited to have you. First podcast ever. 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 Mm -hmm. Ever. Love it. Hey, lucky you fans, you get Yuko on her first <laughs> podcast. <laughs> so Yuko, tell everybody listening, we're going to put swimsuit and calendar aside for a minute. Tell everybody a little bit about your background, DCC experience, what got you here, your story. Give it to us. Okay, perfect. Um, I was doing a rhythmic gymnastic for 10 years. And after that, I studied a pump dance, like a chia dance mm -hmm. in high school. And then when I was 18 years old, I came to Dallas for participate in an um, all-American competition yeah. as a Japanese representative. And then that's why I came to Dallas. And then that's why I kind of started to dreaming to be a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. And then, yeah, I went to airport when I got back to Japan after competition. I went to pro shop, the cowboy's pro shop, and I found the DCC calendar, and yeah. I was like, what is this? And then like a blonde, beautiful girl is shaking palm. <laughs> is this cheerleader? And I was like a ponytail, no makeup, like a jersey, yeah. <laughs> high school judge. I was like, so gorgeous. And then when I got home and I checked the website, and then, oh my God, so beautiful. I want to do this you know and then in high s in no in university i did basketball baseball soccer i did cheer for them like every team was pro team mm -hmm. and then my mind is already you know getting ready for the dcc auditions mm -hmm. so and i am i met yoshiko She's former Japanese cheerleader, mm -hmm. DCC Japanese cheerleader. And then she's awesome. Like she taught me like everything, like how can I be a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader? That is the awesome, she's just awesome. And I, I tried out for Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. I remember when I came here, I was like totally different planet, you know? Oh <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I can only imagine. <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay, how can I buy egg? How can I cook? <laughs> How to use, like, you know, everything. Totally, yeah. But, you know, now I feel, like, so comfortable. Like, my first year, I miss my family a lot. But now he'll, uh, now I feel like, you you're family? my family. Yeah. Like, Aww. you're my family. Like, Judy and Katie, like, everyone, like, my family. Like, you know, I'm so comfortable. I'm so happy to be here. Well, we're so happy you Yay. auditioned. And you made it on your first try in auditions, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. How yeah. did auditions this year go for you? This year is like, um, it's more nervous than my first year, honestly. My first year is, I don't know everything. I'm just like, do my best. Like every year, I feel like that, but mm -hmm. my third year is like, I really want to be here, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. I know how amazing this organization, how amazing, like, every opportunity is really, really good amazing like you know i love the people so it's kind of like so nervous mm -hmm. but you know just i tried to think about like show me like my personality mm -hmm. like hey you got a good one of those yes, yes. <laughs> yes. 
So like kind of nervous, but that was so much fun. Yeah. And Molly, how'd auditions go for you? They went really well. So like Hugo said, I think coming back, it's more nerve wracking because yes. you know what yeah. there is to lose. And, mm -hmm. you know, you don't want to... You don't want to leave the family that you've, you know, mm -hmm. built and your friends. And so, you know, and they expect more out of you because it's your second year. You know, you, they expect that you progress and um, got stronger as a dancer and a representative of the Cowboys. And so it was definitely, I want to say, more nerve wracking than the first year. But it went well because here yay. they are. Yeah, they made it. it. <laughs> how did how would you say your first year on the team went? It was really amazing. I mean, it flew by. I we were all talking about how we can't believe how tryouts are already back. We're like, what? This feels like it was just yesterday. Um, but I think it flew by because it was so much fun and just unbelievable. Just a great experience. Um, I got to do things that I never thought I would ever get to do, like dance on the stage with Thomas Red with all of That's us, awesome. um, which is like unreal because I'm a huge fan. Um, but it went really, really well. It was so much fun, and I'm just happy to be ending it now here in Bimini. So Yeah, I would say that's <laughs> a pretty good reward, making yes. it back. So back. your first calendar shoot, obviously. Yes. What? Where's your mind at right now? Oh, gosh. My mind, I think I'm just super nervous. I think I just want to, you know, get out there and at least just get the first few shots, and then hopefully that'll make me feel more comfortable. But, yeah, I guess I just have no idea what to expect because I've never done something like this before. Um, no modeling ever? <laughs> no modeling ever. I mean, except for, you know, your eighth grade, like, selfies. Yeah. <laughs> duck face. But you think you're modeling. Yeah, exactly, the duck face. But the then you on. look back and you know you're totally not modeling. Oh, yes. You look back on those pictures, you're like, oh, okay. <laughs> That's why I never did that. <laughs> but, um, no, yeah, so I'm, I'm excited, but definitely nervous. And just I've seen some of the pictures that um, some of the girls have taken already, and I'm like, oh, my goodness. They're like, so hot. So oh my hot. god i was like they are so beautiful so i'm like i think we have a great team here and i mean they're naturally hot to begin with but <laughs> i'm just saying i think that you know we have enhance the beauty enhance their natural beauty so i'm hoping <laughs> that they can do the same for me <laughs> has anybody given you any piece of advice that's really stuck with you that you think you're going to use out there i think just be as confident as you can and don't be afraid to just get out there and loosen up because you know your nerves show in pictures so mm -hmm. I think that's just the biggest piece of advice I've gotten is just have fun with it because the having fun shows in the pictures. And you go year two for you here at the calendar shoot. How did last year go for you? Oh, last year it was kind of like so much fun, you know, but like kind of now I was like, how can I pose? Like, yes. you know, what do my I do with my body? Like, yes, exactly. My limbs. <laughs> and in my hands, like this. Uh. <laughs> More chill, like, okay. Still, like, you know. <laughs> Yes, yeah. but you know, kind of, I learned how to posing, like you know, just chill, like enjoy, like, like you know. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like you're more prepared this time around? Um, I think. Fingers <laughs> crossed. <laughs> I think, yeah, like. Mm -hmm. When is your When is your first shoot day? On uh, my first shoot day is day five. Okay. So Wednesday. Ah, so it's far. Kind of, yeah. I'm day five out of day seven. So kind of last day. But you looked good <laughs> last year, so I'm sure it'll, it'll oh be just God. as good this year. Thank you. Yes, and what about you, Molly? When are you shooting? I am Monday and Wednesday. So I think that would be... Are you with Yuko on Wednesday? <gasps> no, I no. wish. We're on the other team. but Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So we'll get to same day, but not together. So. What are you looking most forward to outside of photo shoots here in Bimini? I mean, everyone's just <laughs> raved about the food here, so <laughs> I would say probably that. But if, you've, if you've watched Molly's episode of These Boots Are Made For Talking, I, I can confirm she loves, appreciates Appreciate. the fine art that is culinary <laughs> cuisine. <laughs> A good old foodie. Have you had anything yet that's amazing? Oh yes. The fruit here is unbelievable. Like, I'm like, it's just so fresh and bright, and oh, it's the best, so... Did you try conch yet, or have you tried conch, Yuko? Yes. No. It was good. I thought I tried. It's like good. A fritter. Really? Oh, so is yeah, that? It's it fried. Really it was fried. I don't Which know. It scares me just seeing them rip it right out of the shell. I didn't get to see it. I wish I saw <laughs> it. Maybe if I saw it, I wouldn't have eaten it. I mean, like, but. But the fried one was good. It looked great as a fried pizza. What is it fried called again? Pizza. <laughs> fried pizza. A fried, fried pizza. pizza. 
Right conk. piece of conk. Okay. It was it's, like, what is that called it's crazy though. Yesterday riding around the island, you will literally look and along the water line, I don't know if you mm-hmm. noticed this last year, I mean piles of thousands of conch shells. It's oh, insane. Yeah. Yeah. I saw that. They're everywhere. They're used as like centerpieces. We had them at dinner, like all lined up. Everywhere. Beautiful. Yeah. It's insane. <laughs> <laughs> Unreal. So yesterday was first day here. How'd you guys spend your time? It was a little rainy. Nice. We're we're lucky today because the sun looks like it's mm-hmm. poking through. So mm-hmm. once we're done shooting these boots are made for talking, we're gonna go shoot some pictures. So we can't wait for that. But how'd you guys spend your time yesterday? We had the day off, so Yeah. Yep. I went to beach with my teammate and then um, Oh my God, beach was so beautiful. And then like, you know, people were so nice. We just lay the lay down and sleep yeah. and then relax yeah. and then come back. And then have you tried bimini toast? Bimini toast? Like French toast? No, uh, yeah. what is it? Yeah. Yeah. Like bimini toast is like a very maple. Like, a, yeah, like a French toast. It's really good. But better? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Everything's better. So I should try it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You, you got should. it down at the beach? Oh, not or here. here. Okay, because mm-hmm. I was gonna say that sounds like a yeah. dream. Well, if you guys are ever coming to Resorts World Bimini, you should listen to Yuko and Bimini toast. get the Bimini toast, and maybe I can confirm next episode if it's great or not. <laughs> we'll Perfect. see. We'll see. So some of the girls here, shockingly enough, had never even been to a beach. Some yeah. had never used yes! their passports. Yes! Was that the case? Go. Was that the case for either of you? Had you been to anything, l- any place like this ever before? I had never been to the Bahamas. I'd been to Mexico, a few beaches before, but um, never a beach as blue, with the water as blue as mm. this. I was like, is this real life? It looks like a painting out here. No <laughs> picture can do the watercolor justice. Color justice. Yes. No. I was like, what? This is real? Yeah. And the water's so warm, and the beaches are like white sand. It's like something you see on a postcard. No <laughs> like filter. These no hashtag, no, no, no filter. No it's real. It's real. Yeah. Too real. The color of your outfit, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> okay. So, it's been a hot minute since I've had you on the show, and I haven't had you on the show before yet, Yuko. So, what have you guys been up to since the last time I saw you, and just how d- how have you been in the past, let's just say, past season? Anything new and exciting happening in life that everybody needs and wants to know? For me, I've just been, since I was last on the show, I think just prepping for tryouts a lot. Um, trying to run, get my stamina up for tryouts, um, and just working, just working, and but just yeah. oh, working and won the NCAA tournament bracket in your office. <gasps> yes, I don't know how it happened. I won out of there's like 150 to 200 people in my office, and everyone put in you know their March Madness bracket, and a lot of people like all the. Um, especially the men at my office who are a lot of huge um, basketball fans. They were like, are you going to do a bracket? And I was like, eh, nah, like I'm okay. I'm like, just put one in. Last minute, I was like, okay, fine. I'll just choose. I was like, I like that color. <laughs> I was like, that I, mascot is cute. Yeah, I was like, that's a cool name. I'm going to do that. And I won the whole thing. I have no idea how. So I won this huge trophy and bragging rights for a year. So you're gonna keep it with you the whole year? Um, yes. Yeah, so they put my name plate on it with my name, so it'll just forever be on there. And like, I was like, I'm not worthy. I didn't even watch one of the games. <laughs> <laughs> but I just, it's all luck, I guess. So hey, that's basically that's what, what it is. That's what I've been up to. Thank Win- you for winning championships me. is what yeah. Molly's been doing. <laughs> and what have you been doing? Have you been home, or do you have any plans to go home? I went to home in January. Okay. And then maybe next year I go back home. But my family is going to come. Oh, they come? Going season. Yeah. Have you been here? Yes. Okay. My dad came last year. That was my first two visit time to Dallas. And also his first football game in his oh, life. Oh, cool. First football, football game. And what do you think of it? <laughs> he said, what is this? Like, you know, yeah. how huge at t Stadium? Right. Oh, my God. So, so huge. huge. And he was like, oh, my God, just, you know, like yeah. he was so excited and he learned football. Does he understand <laughs> it? Yes. Yes. He learned football in his home. Okay. And they come here and I'm watching the game. Mm-hmm. And then my mom, it's second time to watching the game. So he ca- she came in my first year, too. She, so she was kind of like chill, like. I got yeah. this. Yeah. There is Yuko. <laughs> yeah. He's fangirling. She yes. Like, eh, been here, yes. done that. 
So do all your family and friends back home truly get what you do out here, or do they still not get it? No, they love it. They, they do? They love it. Cool. And then, like, <laughs> every time, like, DCC Twitter, DCC Facebook, mm -hmm. Instagram, post something about me, I got a lot of email. Like, my friends, I saw that you go! Like, you know? And I was like, oh, my God. This is so sweet. Well, we'll have to make sure we get some pictures of you up from Bimini so you yeah. get all those texts and emails. <laughs> do they think that you being here is unreal? What do they think of that? They say that it's really beautiful. Mm. I think, th I think you know, it's unreal. I mm. have never saw like this beautiful s be beach. Like yeah. weather is really cool. Like, you know, it, they're like, it's real. Yeah. It's real. It's oh, real. It's real. I lived yeah. it. it's real. We can confirm. Mm -hmm. And are all your friends and family absolutely jealous, or oh. what are they thinking? Yes, I almost feel guilty because they're all like, I'm at work right now, and I'm like, I am too. Technically, technically <laughs> but we're it beats being in the office exactly so oh yeah they're so excited they're just like they're still like living the dream with me like is this are you serious right now i'm like i don't know i think this is real so that's so it's fun. really neat but so something people may not know is that cmt is actually here mm -hmm. shooting calendar mm -hmm. i guess maybe you might know better because you were here last year you mm -hmm. go how does or does it even change anything or is it still the same Having CMT here, um, you know, we just like have a like interview time, mm -hmm. but like basically same. You know, CMT the show is a truly like true story to be a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. So it's gonna be this season. It's so much fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. Does that make you more nervous having them here? Both me? Of you. Oh, Does it make both me. of you more nervous? <laughs> yes, yeah. yeah. Yes, ma'am, for sure. But just because you know what. It's true. I mean, like you said, it's just getting you get you get to know them though. Yeah. After a while, hopefully, I haven't been on a shoot yet with them, but hopefully, they just are observers, right? Just in the background, just don't get too in the way. <laughs> and you know what? One day we'll probably look back and appreciate it because yeah, like, you'll oh, be thankful. Now we get to rewatch it back, and but then you'll be like, oh it. no, they showed that. Yes, exactly. <laughs> they get all up and personal. And yeah, yeah, but we can talk right. to them, like you know, like. CMT and us is really closer because, mm -hmm. like, uh, they follow us before the audition. Mm -hmm. Like, my first right. year, you know, they follow me before the audition. And then now, like, third year, mm -hmm. it's, like, not strangers. They're, like, friends. Right. Yeah. Right. So, like, uh, oh, my God, your friends is here. Like, you know. Yeah. Like, hey. You can have fun with them. And, and they'll be honest. Like, you know what? Let's reword. Like, you know, let's restate that in a different way. Or, you know, for interviews, they they have our back, so mm -hmm. which is nice. Make too. you want to look good. Yes, so nice. exactly. Yeah. So, although, even though they make us more nervous, we love them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're happy to be on vacation with them. Yeah. Hey. hey. <laughs> and you said you go that they did your backstory. Did they go to Japan, or was it once you were here in the states they were fo kind of following you around? Oh, like a TV show? Yeah. In were Japan? Th were they there? Did CMT go to Japan, or was it just when you got here? <laughs> Just got here. Okay, I was yeah. like, wow, they took that big of a flight. Right. Oh my god! I, I hope, but yeah, I came to like three months before the audition, my first year. Mm -hmm. So I was in here in February, and the audition was oh. in May, and uh, I went to a lot prep class. Right. So and uh, how that's how we met, like me and the same team met right. there. So. Yeah, kind of there long. we go. I was like, dang, they found you all the way out in Japan. I know. Yes. Yes. We all take a trip. Yeah, I want to go. Take a trip. Yes. Japan. Yes. You could show Please us come. Japan. You should yeah. bring everybody. Uh, yes. Or yeah. maybe we could shoot some type of calendar in Japan. Oh my gosh, yes. so cool. Beaches. Mm -hmm. <laughs> beaches like Okinawa. Uh, mm -hmm. That's beautiful. It's really beautiful beaches there. How so. do the beaches compare to this? It's art. Uh, uh, I love here, honestly. Yeah. yeah. Different. I, I don't even know what a Japanese beach looks like. I'm gonna either. have to Google it. I know. Me too. Uh -huh. You'll okay. have to give us all the names. Check it out. Yeah. But if I ever go to Japan, I'll have to put that on the list. Yeah, <laughs> I go to the beaches because I really want to go to Tokyo, too. I feel yeah. like that looks amazing. Tokyo, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like a New York City. It's very, be, very like, busy. Mm -hmm. Like, a lot of people there. Mm -hmm. Like, if you want to more have chill, like, relax. Mm -hmm. Okinawa is good. Like, Hokkaido is, like, a very good seafood. Mm -hmm. So, it's a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. And Tess, she loves Japanese food. Yeah. And <laughs> I'm sure, like, me and the test, the first conversation is about sushi. Yes. 
Yeah, I'm for she sure. Like she's it. like, do I love sushi? You go. <laughs> She's like, I just want to come to Japan. Thanks, Des. Me too. I love sushi too. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. Have you have you had sushi from the restaurant here? I heard it's so good. Not yet, but I went to last year. Okay, mm-hmm. I've heard it's amazing. So good. Yeah. I'm not a sushi or seafood gal, but maybe if you love it and you know about it, yeah, you can teach me and I'll try it and yes, make my mom happy for trying it. Yes, yes. salmon is good. really good. Salmon here, awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so fresh. Fresh. We hit it in Texas, and we're like, oh, "Where's the nearest ocean?" Yeah, there is not a nearest ocean. Yeah. But here in we're like, Dallas. Oh, so right fresh. There. <laughs> right that right fresh there. conch. Yeah, that fresh All conch. Right. Exactly. Well, I think our time is winding down. The sun is out. The sun is beautiful. Yeah. It's time to go take some pictures yeah. with these two lovely ladies. We're gonna meet up with a couple other Ooh. girls. I'm not gonna spoil it and say who they are. So you'll just have to check out all of the DCC social media today to find out who we're shooting with. Yay. It'll be Woo-hoo. fun with two other girls out there. We all love them. I'm excited to go see them. Mm-hmm. So we gotta we gotta jump on a golf cart and go find them because I'm not even sure where they are. Yep. And we got some pictures to take here in Bimini Bliss. So be sure to follow along at DC Cheerleaders, hashtag Bimini Bliss, hashtag DCC Swim. And we can't wait to see you again tomorrow. See you tomorrow.